Most people in Austin have power and running water back, but smaller communities outside of Austin are still struggling after February's winter storms. The hill country town of Harper, west of Fredericksburg, got help from an unlikely source. Here's Hank Cavanera. Many of us are taught to love thy neighbor. You know, I was out here two weeks ago. It was a Saturday, Sunday. Aaron Davis is then... taking that to heart. Helping those in Harper, Texas, those who you wouldn't normally call his neighbor. Because this isn't his home. <laughs> No, no, that's that's back in uh, back in Plant City, Florida, just uh, a town just east of Tampa. Yeah. Originally, Aaron came to Texas to help his long distance girlfriend, but after she was taken care of, he heard others needed help. I said the least that I could do is just maybe supply some of the you know some of the things that I can get my hands on, um, so that they've got you know be better equipment, replace the stuff that they've been tearing up, you know their own personal items and um, you know, do some good. Aaron started by getting more chainsaws. Then he got a GoFundMe up and running to help get the town support. His story now reaching across the country, back where he lives in Tampa and even in People Magazine. So I show up here, I'm like, this is like my town. And these people were so like, the open arms, so welcoming when I got here. This is a place that I would, I would call home. This feels like home. Now, when driving around, he can see the impact he and others have made. Yeah, yeah, this playground uh, right over here, um, you know, there's like I said, there's just trees down, you know, all over the place. Um, so we identified, you know, a handful of areas that were just kind of like, you know, public spaces and then identified, you know, people with, with needs that weren't gonna be able to do it themselves. You know, so. Helping a small town get back on their feet and finding new neighbors. To love. It feels like I, I recognize the names and I recognize the last names and now all of a sudden it's like I, I feel like I know their kids and stuff. In Harper, I'm Hank Kevinera. People just stepping up to help. I love it. Well, so far, Davis has helped raise about $70,000 for the people in Harper. And if you would like to help, we've posted more information with this story on our website, kv.com.